Hi guys, Captain Orion here, and with the next update for Toy Story and Stitch dropping tomorrow, let's take a look at the patch notes to look at what else we can expect in the next update. Now first, let's talk about optimization. The update itself drops at 9am ET, which is approximately 2pm GMT, and with it comes optimi optimizations across all platforms, with them specifically noting that Nintendo players will see a much smoother performance as well as the game now being compatible with the Steam Deck. It also includes reduced loading times which I know is going to be a welcome change for everyone coming and playing this game. Seasonally. Now, in terms of new changes with the winter season, they've mentioned you are now able to manually light many of the fireplaces throughout Dreamlight Valley with the exception of a few such as the Celestial Fireplace, just to name a few, that I will mention, I'll include the patch notes below so you guys can check those out. Gameplay wise, this new update brings about some much welcome changes to the gameplay which is honestly such a relief to any player that has been grinding for materials in this game. Specifically they note that Kristoff has expanded the inventory of his store to include a wider range of items and this includes iron ingots, finally. Alongside this they also mention that they have improved the wood distribution across all of the biomes. Now this change will make sure that the wood you find in each area is less random, however they have mentioned that the spawn rates will be reduced. Pain, I know. However it's not all bad news as they mentioned that there is a set amount of wood that can spawn and it will also appear in consistent amounts which means hopefully we don't have to spend ages trying to collect all the hardwood for quests like we did last time. Another fantastic update is that you will now be able to feed critters multiple times per day meaning that you can now befriend your favourite companion much much easier. That's it for our quick wrap up today guys and when the update does drop we can take a deep dive into both Toy Story and Stitch to learn much more about what this update includes. Don't forget to leave a like if you found this video helpful and to subscribe to stay up to date on all things Dreamlight Valley. Until next time guys, I'll see you later.